got to tell him a very important secret. How you pick me up? How you pick me up at Home Depot? Are you good? Did you get the... Did you pick up the... Uh, yeah, I'm going to go through again. Did you bring it? Yeah, I brought it. I actually busted here. I busted here, but I'll bring it next time. I don't have it on me. You don't have You don't have it on you. We got to do that right after this. I'll, I'll go home and pick it up. I'll run home. Our dad's run home. You're funny. No, no, no you don't no, have to come. No, 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 I appreciate it. I'm just with you. Take care, bro. I love you. Love you, senior, bro. I love you, bro. Love you, too. So anyways, Jacob asked me a good question. Really, 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 really good question. He was like, how do you really get big? Like, genuinely, that was his question. We're going to bring this back to the to the, the old times. The people who remember this back in 2015 times when I would talk. Because I got something really important to tell you guys. Anyways, Jacob was like, how do you really get big? Because I know Jacob's gone through, like, trying to get big, trying to get lean. And I was sitting there, and I was thinking about this. And I was like, damn. It's a good question. We were joking like steroids and eating and consistency and all this stuff. And you know, we're like, oh, okay, well, steroids, yeah, make it go faster or whatever, right? But like, does it does it sustain? Do you sustain it? What up, man? Good to Lost see you. Good. Yes, sir. Despite that, though, this is the this is the key, right? Whether you're doing that or not, irrelevant. Because yeah, it's gonna make it happen faster, or whatever. But the real question I was saying that was really interesting to me about this is why do we just straight up not do the things? that we know we need to do that are best for us. That's the true question. Why do humans, we do it in friendships, we do it in relationships, we do it like in all aspects of our life when we're just, we're just, we're, we're knowing. Cause like, I guarantee you if I told you right now, if you came to me and you said, yo Brad, how do I get big? There's all these things you can do. You know like the root cause, like and the root effect is you eating enough, training hard enough, being consistent enough, getting enough sleep, drinking enough water. Like you know that and at this point, 2023, you probably heard that like, you probably heard it a million times, so you know the truth. So the real question is not like, how do you do it? The real question is, what is stopping you from doing it? And that's the thing we have to like start to try to understand within ourselves. Like, there's so much I can look back on uh, my life and like there's certain you know relationships, there's certain goals, there's certain things that I had flopped because I wasn't ready to receive it yet because I felt like I wasn't worth having it yet or I felt like uh, I wouldn't be a good good enough when I had it or I uh, I thought that like, you know, maybe that, that thing that I want is just reserved for other people and not reserved for me because I grew up this way. So the true question is like, are you willing to do the work inside? Are you willing to look inside and go, okay, what's stopping me truly from getting it? Because if there was nothing stopping you in here from like choosing to make those decisions every day and to not go back, you know, let's say you have a hard time not eating shitty food, right? So every time you're like, okay, I need to diet. I want to lose weight. What do I do? And you know, like you're not supposed to reach for that hog and dogs. You know, you're not supposed to get that pint of Ben and Jerry's. You know, you're not supposed to eat those donuts. Like, but for some reason within you, you can't decide, okay, I'm not doing this in this moment. And then in the next moment, the next time it comes around next time, because there's something deeper there. I'm, I'm not saying like, you know, your, your, your dad left you or your mom left you, or you got this crazy trauma. So now you're eating Ben and Jerry's ice cream and like eating donuts. That's not what I'm saying. But the reality is you're making those conscious decisions in the moment to like not truly choose yourself and what's really important to you. Then again, question might be, is the goal is the thing that you're trying to succeed at? Is it actually truly important to you? So two things there. The real question is why are we choosing not to put ourselves first in these circumstances so that we can get the things that we want out of the actions that we're taking and then truly stay consistent in it? Or the other question we got to ask ourselves is, is it something that you truly want in your life? And if it's something you truly want in your life, then you're going to like all that, all those, all that other nonsense is going to kind of drift away. And yeah, it's still at times it's going to come up and still at times you're going to fumble and still at times you're going to and make mistakes. But the reality is like, if you keep coming back to that moment and you're willing to put in the work and the effort and the energy it takes to continue to go forward, then you're going to have what you want, right? You have to make those 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 two things understood like you have to go deeper sometimes because the thing that holds us back is not always the thing that's right here in front of us it's really easy to get caught up in what's in front of us and go it's that person's fault it's his fault it, you know if i didn't do this and that would happen it's easy to like use those excuses because it's like human nature to make things more simple for us but the reality is the stuff that makes you the best version of yourself is when you go deep and you look deeper and you understand okay this is what i really need to change and i'm not afraid of looking at it anymore I'm not afraid of changing it. I'm not afraid of going forward in my life the way that I've, I've always wanted to or whatever the goal was. Like, you can't live on all those preconceived ideas that you've had in the past. You have to continue to evolve. And everyone knows this. Be present. Be in the moment. Like, that's what that means. It means allowing yourself to be, like, in this sort of flow right now, right here, listening to this video. Once you're done with this video, you're going to subscribe. That's me saying that as a YouTuber, right? But beyond that, dropping a comment, dropping a like, all that good stuff. Beyond that, when you leave this video, the question to yourself is, 
are you gonna do what you know you need to do? So, the answer's yours. I love you guys. Subscribe to the channel every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I told you guys I'm gonna talk a lot more to you because I got a lot more to say. I've had a lot to say, I just had to say it. Honestly, because I got kind of lost in like just this like chase of shit. Like my own personal battle within like the internet, making content, and having to be a certain way and all these expectations. And I just realized like, it, I'm gonna do my best. I'm gonna show up how I can. What, that guy was smoking loud. Was smoking Super hello. loud. <laughs> he was like, damn. But uh, no, I actually stopped smoking. Anyways. What the fuck are you talking about? Just kidding, I, I just smoked today. For the first time in a long time. Why? I wanted to, just, I just wanted to try it again. I was like, let me see what this is like. That's the truth. I was It's pretty good, I had a nice little zone. I was in the zone, saw. Had a nice little workout, little pump, my muscle connection. Kind of like relax about some other things and you know, just get the work in. Then again, I don't, even, I don't even know, we'll probably cut it where I cut it earlier. Probably before that car, cause it was a really cool ending. Maybe end like right at the car. I don't know dude, honestly I don't even care at this point, just post the whole video. Okay. Like, it. We'll just do it, we'll kick it old school. Nadeem Boom. style. Nadeem style where we just fucking An hour long, through. no fucking this cuts. <laughs> hour long, no cuts. But it's like, this is honestly just me. Like I'm not, there's no script, I'm not cutting it. I'm not trying to make myself look a certain way. Like, even though I did tell Jacob, I was like, yo, it'd be cool if you sauce a little like low live music under that. It made me sound like fucking epic, you know? And then like clip it, it could be on like TikTok and be like, yo, that shit was deep, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, that's it. I love you guys. I'm out of here.